Hello everyone, welcome back to Catherine's Plates where it's simply delicious. Today I'm going to show you how to make a no-bake easy pina colada cream pie. I love this one. It's summertime. This fits the bill with a no-bake dessert. It's cool, it's refreshing. If you love the flavor combinations of pineapple and coconut, you're going to love this one. All right, I've got everything ready right here to go ahead and start making that easy crust. So let's put this one together. Okay, to make the crust, you're gonna need a food processor, some graham crackers, melted butter, white granulated sugar, and a pie plate. So what we're gonna do is take our graham crackers out of the packaging and we're gonna place them into our food processor. Now you can use an already pie crust if you want to do that, but I love to make my own homemade. They just taste better. So that's two packets and then I'm going to put in half of another package. So we'll do these four here. Now I'm talking this size right here, you'll need 20 of those. Break them up. So to fit in here good. Then we're going to pulse these until we get a fine crumb. Okay, now what we're going to do is add a quarter cup of white granulated sugar. I'm just gonna add it right to the crumb mixture. And then we're gonna add half a cup of melted butter. So one full stick or eight tablespoons. You just wanna make it sure it's melted. Then put the lid back on. And pulse that till it's all combined. Oh yeah, that looks really good. All right, I'm gonna take the blade out. We're gonna pour the mixture into a pie plate. I'm using a nine inch deep pie plate. I'm just gonna use a spoon, press it really evenly on the bottom and up the sides. Okay, now what we're gonna do is place this in the refrigerator to chill and set up while we make the mixture. In a medium bowl, we're going to add one cup of heavy whipping cream. All right, we're going to beat this until we get nice soft peaks. That's soft peaks, you can tell. Yeah, it holds its shape, but it's nice and soft. I'm just gonna pop this in the refrigerator for just a few minutes. In a large bowl, we're gonna take eight ounces of cream cheese. You wanna make sure that it's very soft. So leave it on your counter for at least over an hour. And then we're going to cream this until it's nice and soft and smooth. We're going to add in a quarter cup of white granulated sugar. 
one teaspoon of rum extract that rum extract gives it a good flavor and then we're going to put in half a teaspoon of vanilla extract we're going to beat this until it's all combined pull down the sides You're going to need a 20 ounce can of crushed pineapple. Now I'm going to drain it and get all the excess juice out. So we don't want this wet. We'll make a good juice to drink while waiting for this pie. <laughs> Just put your strainer over a bowl or whatever you can find. Pour your pineapple into it. Use your spoon and just start squeezing the juice out. All right, we're going to add that to our cream cheese mixture. All right, we're going to add one cup of sweetened coconut flakes. All right, we're going to mix this together. Just until combined. We're done with the mixer. All right, we're going to scrape down the sides. We're going to take our chilled whip topping and add it. And then we're going to fold it in. smells scrumptious in there. Okay, we're going to bring over our chilled pie crust and we're going to spoon the batter into it. Smooth it out evenly. Make sure you can see the crust. Can y'all see the little bits of pineapple in there? <laughs> yeah. Oh. All right, we're going to place this in the refrigerator covered for four hours at least. That way it'll help set up this pie. And then I'm going to give this a try for you. It's been a day. I've just pulled this out of the refrigerator. We're going to go ahead and cut a slice. There we go. Pina Colada Cream Pie. You take a bite for you. All right, I'm having to do this bite by myself. <laughs> my husband doesn't do coconut, but that's okay. I have my mom, me, two kids <laughs> that love pineapple and coconut together for a pina colada flavor. Mm. Cool, refreshing. That's very delicious. Mm. All right, you saw how easy that was. No baking involved whatsoever. That is very scrumptious. All right, now don't worry about my husband. I have a dessert in mind for him that I will be making. So y'all will be seeing that one coming up soon. 
All right, give me a thumbs up on this one. Comment down below what you think. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. That way, you'll always know when shows like this one here are posted. I'll see you on the next episode.